Jeffrey Powers, Geekazine, NAB 2024, Joe DeMax. We've got a new standalone module and NDI integration. We're going to be talking about that next on Geekazine. So this is a new X-Keys bundle with, uh, you get a 96 key unit and you get a T-Buy unit. And it's, this is the layout I've gone with. You don't have to do that, it's an X-Keys. Build it whatever you want, order whatever custom keys you like, lay it out however you so choose. Now and this has got an orange pie inside of here, right? It has got a single board computer inside it and that is running central control internally, giving you basically a complete self-contained control system. You log in via a, a web interface, yeah. you do all your setup. But you don't need that. You don't. You. Once it's set Once up, you set it, it's, you set it's it good up, to go, yeah. Get rid of the laptop and you've got a complete self-contained central control system. All you, once, you, once you get everything in the computer, all you have to do is bring this unit, which is great. Because if I'm doing any type of travel, especially overseas, having I'll have the computer nearby, but yeah. having it not able to, not having it on the, on the table is always a good thing. Yep. You can pull it up on whatever device you need to to configure there it. There you go. No okay. installation required. Awesome. And then, of course, uh, this is hooked up to a uh, uh, ATEM Mini Extreme. We've got a Mini Extreme. We've got a graphics system. Uh, we've got a Hyperdeck for video playback. So, I mean, this is just here really to represent a, you know, your average production, small production studio setup. But you can do vMix, TriCaster, FreePlay. Nearly any module in the Windows version of Central Control is here too. All right. So you also announced something with NDI. Tell us a little bit about so that. So the feature is called Central Control Link. Okay. As soon as you've got a control surface in your project, so an X keys, a MIDI controller, anything like that, it becomes advertised as an NDI source. Really? And then wow. that can be picked up on another instance of central control. And then you can have it just instead of USB, it's now over the network. And it works just as if it was on your desk. This is really cool over the LAN. Yeah. But if you're doing cloud production, yep. this works over NDI Bridge. So if I've got a bunch of X keys on my desk, I can have that go straight to the cloud. Okay. And when you consider that that works on the embedded products like this, this can be a remote control surface for a cloud production all That's its awesome. own. That's awesome. That this for your uh, for your Black Magic, for your VMix, for anything like that. Yeah. That's awesome. And he's got. We, we saw it over there. We saw a little box with a Stream Deck in it, and that was controlling this this machine over right here. here. Yep. And of course, you got uh, through the interface. Uh, you can make all the adjustments. And um, so all the mapping is done on the like the main central control system, if you like. Mm -hmm. So if you've got a production, there's like an engineer in charge. They they can be looking after all of that. And then the remote operators don't really need to consider anything. They just have to have the central control running to make those sources available as NDI, those controllers available as NDI, and then they're in the production, they've got control over whatever they need to. Oh, wow. And is it NDI 6 that's running, or? It's 5, but it'll be, by the time this ships, it'll be NDI okay. 6. Okay, and, yep. and when's it planning on shipping? Uh, this will be out in mid-May. Mid-May? Awesome, yep. cool, cool, cool. Just amazing stuff from uh, Central Control over at centralcontrol.com. IO. Dot IO. Dot That's IO. Right. Input output. It, it, input output, yes. Uh, so thank you very much for your thank time. You. So, all right, there you go. Central Control, geekazine.com, youtube.com forward slash geekazine. Go ahead, like, subscribe, comment, bell notification so those YouTubers get their wings. And until next time, from NAB 2024, geek out and stream on.